What is up guys, it's Tom here and welcome to a brand new transfer news video and today's transfer news is massive Manchester City are in talks over the transfer of Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, one of the best strikers in the world, he's scored 25 goals for the Bundesliga side Dortmund and I just can't believe if if uh, Aubameyang joins Man City, they will have one of the best strike forces in the Premier League. They will have, uh, <laughs> oh my god, Aguero and Aubameyang. And that team, even on FIFA, is devastating, never mind in real life. I think, I think Guardiola is going to make big, big transfer moves. He is worth about 58, 60 million, but Man City could pay even more than that. And uh, Sky Sports are reporting it that uh, Manchester City are in advanced talks with Dortmund, but Dortmund won't let Aubameyang go on the cheap and they won't let him go easily because already Gundogan went to Manchester City and they don't want to lose more than one of their star players this summer, so it will be very interesting. Only Lewandowski scored more goals in the Bundesliga and if I was... Uh, if I was Guardiola, I would go for Aubameyang because I think he would suit the Premier League a lot because uh, in the Bundesliga, you know, Dortmund are playing a similarly fast-paced style and uh, I think it will be very interesting uh, to see whether they can pull it off and I found a very funny article actually in the, in the mirror. They are also reporting on this transfer. Let me know guys, so what, is, what does this mean for the Premier League? I think... Guardiola is not only building a side that is capable of, uh, you know, competing for the Premier League title, he also wants to build a side who can compete for the Champions League trophy because Guardiola is a winner and I think he will want to try and bring the best players in the world to Manchester City and he's only, Aubameyang is only 26 years old and uh, I think he has a good seven, eight years ahead of him, so the potential is also there for Aubameyang to get even better, and that is a frightening prospect. So back to this article, seven things that will happen if Man City actually do sign Aubameyang, and this is actually funny, the Manchester United fans uh, uh, would say, you know, when they sign Ibra that they are getting one of the most favorite strikers, and then the Man City fans, well he's 34, they are, we are getting a striker who is going to be one of the best strikers on the planet for years to come. And Arsenal fans will go probably mental. <laughs> I just found this funny that uh, uh, City get Aubameyang and we can't even get Jamie Vardy. Damn you Wenger, damn you Kronka, <laughs> damn you <laughs> damn you football. Um, and yeah, let's see. So former Hull City striker Daniel Kuzan who played for uh, you know the Hull City a few years back um, got more than 50 Gabon uh, caps and uh, so basically Aubameyang won't be the first player from Gabon uh, in the Premier League and yeah <laughs> the spelling of Aubameyang will, will be actually um, will be actually funny and I would love to see Jurgen Klopp trying to get Aubameyang, but realistically Aubameyang will only go to a club in the Champions League and who can challenge for the Premier League and I'm really really excited to see potentially this this celebration from Aubameyang in the Premier League after he scores a goal he famously pulled on a Spider-Man mask and also a Batman mask in another game with, uh, with Marco Royce and uh, yeah, the, <laughs> the prospect of Aubameyang and Aguero as a strike partnership, we have a lot of people doing this. Oh man. <laughs> and also, the, the, unlike, uh, of unless of course they support Manchester United, in, in which case the reaction might be more like this. <laughs> so yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoy this, uh, this transfer special video. I think with Aubameyang and Aguero, if Man City can sign a couple of defenders, who can improve their defense, they can win the Premier League and they should win the Premier League because on paper Man City have the best squad in the Premier League but not the best starting eleven because their defense is not good enough yet but Guardiola knows that, he will know that looking at the statistics so I think 
I think Aubameyang, if he goes to Manchester City, it will be huge for both Man City in the Premier League, both Man City in the Champions League, and also for the whole Premier League. It will be great to see one of the best strikers in the world in the Premier League banging in the goals. Of course, as a Liverpool fan, that worries me, but, you know, we, at the moment, uh, really should be focusing on ourselves and trying to build the club up back into the Champions League so we can attract players like Aubameyang because at the moment Liverpool can't that's just a real reality anyway thanks for watching I really hope that you enjoyed this video leave a like if you did see you later guys goodbye